Described as a man whose voice commands respect and whose presence evokes a deep sense of conscience, Dr. John Carney's name has been woven through the history of South African theatre and international films. Recently, he created great excitement when he asked the directors of Marvel Cinematic Universe if he could try his dialogue in Koza as part of his character in the Captain America film. He was also announced as one of the leading actors to feature in the animated remake of The Lion King John Carney, so great to have you still. What was their reaction for the, the Captain America thing? Well, on this scene, I'm supposed to be addressing the United Nations. I am King Tichaka of an imaginary country called Wakanda, yeah. northeast of Nigeria. So I'm talking to Scarlett Johansson, who plays the Black Widow. Oh, she's beautiful, and Ch yeah. She's wonderful. She's lovely, isn't she? And uh, Chadwick Brosnan, who is the Black Panther, and my son. So as soon as we finish that conversation, I'm now left alone with my son. And I'm saying to him in English, I haven't seen you. I miss you, my son. I said, excuse me, governor, to the director. Why are we speaking English? We come from Africa and I haven't seen my son. Surely we speak in our native language. Yeah. And then, um, of course, the suggestion from the language and accent coach, you could make any sounds like Honga Ho Tazan language. Yes. We'll get the subtitles correct. I said, no, why can't I speak in my language? Ah. And Chadwick said, okay. Say something. And then I said, Everybody out there says, more of that. More of <laughs> that. Like that, more of that. <laughs> so it was agreed. So I then began to work with Chadwick and everybody that's around me to give each word in Corsa or in every word that they, I would like to say something as well. And that was in Captain America Civil War. We've just completed now the Black Panther, yes, uh, which will be re, uh, released next year. Now all the actors there, we were, even my young son Atandwa, yes. is playing me when I was a prince, uh, and then I take over, and then my son uh, Chadwick takes over. I was the language and accent and culture advisor on what should be done in an African context. Even during the post-production, uh, Cook and Ryan, the director would call me and says, Dr. Kani, we're trying to say something, or Forrest Whitaker wants to know, how can he say this? <laughs> Michael B. Jordan wants to know, Lapita Nyong'o, you know, people, with, with, with Angela Bassett said, how do I greet my husband? Do I say, hello father, or hello husband? So you keep advising. So it was incredibly for me an honor that Isikosa was adopted as the official language of Wakanda in the Black Panther comic story. Isn't that the most incredible story? I love that. I think that's beautiful. And then there was a, a tweet we received. I'm looking at the time because I've got to take a break now before we get to the news. But, but somebody wrote a tweet and said, can you please stop telling people t saying that, uh, that John Carney is going to be starring with Beyonce in The Lion King. It's the other way around. Beyonce is lucky <laughs> enough to be with John Carney in The Lion King. And that's a big deal. That's a really lovely deal because again, this is a South African written production that is once again being remade in Hollywood. But you're there. You're Rafiki. You're the voice of Rafiki. That was amazing. Incredible. It's, it's, is it Max Maponyana? No, his son. His son. Yes, his son. Uh, uh, um, what's Maps. his? Maps. Maps. Maps, yes. Yeah, my daughter said, Dad, I'm going to show you a tweet quickly. So he said, I don't, I'm not on Facebook. I don't tweet. I'm yeah. 74 years old. I can't handle it. You don't need this. this. It's, I don't it need gets this. horrible. He said, look, Daddy. Maps says, let me correct E-N-C-A. -E it's actually, Beyonce will be starting alongside John Carney, the go. legendary. Outstanding. It, it, there you go. I'm glad it was ENC and not SABC. See, SABC <laughs> would never say something like that. <laughs> John, I'm going to get into trouble. I'm going to take a break. And then we wrap this up. We've got the news at 8. Then we're going to wrap up our conversation with John. Write a question if you'd like to, and we can pose it to him.